2018, the state will be opening a pop-up vaccination clinic in the Maplewood area in the city of Rochester. This in an effort to bring more of the shot to zip codes with low vaccination rates and push us further down the path to herd immunity. Atia Collins has a story for us. The president would like 70% of the population to be vaccinated before July 4th. And to get us there, leaders here locally are focusing on partnering with community organizations and putting the vaccine in zip codes with low vaccination rates like the Maplewood area. When it comes to reaching herd immunity, the challenge is no longer vaccine supply, but vaccine hesitancy. We have to stop grouping people and their concerns, and we have to start treating people as individuals um, and v validating their real and legitimate concerns. That's why leaders say it's important to partner with organizations and zip codes with low vaccination rates. We're not sure why these zip codes have lower rates. Uh, we think in many cases it's not because there hasn't been vaccine in that area uh, or vaccine that's been accessible. We think it's it has more to do with um, people just finding a convenient time to come, wanting to come. The state is partnering with the Greater Harvest Baptist Church to bring shots to the 14613 zip code. According to the Finger Lakes Vaccine Hub data portal, 14613 has the lowest vaccination rate for the city of Rochester, with just 34.5% of residents with at least one dose compared to 63.4% for Monroe County. The distribution effort is not only about location, but leaders are focusing on utilizing trusted community leaders to bring numbers up. That might be the person who does your hair. You know, it might be uh, your pastor in your church. It might be uh, your doctor. Looking for those trusted people that can talk to people about the importance of this is what we're trying to do. Now, if you at home got your own COVID-19 shot, leaders say you can help us reach herd immunity by talking to those you know and sharing your experience. Reporting in Rochester, Atia Collins, News 8.